What's cracking with you, YouTube? This your man King Howie back with another video. And let's get into it. Is there trouble in paradise? You would think after winning the championship that all will all would be good in uh Golden State. You know, um after acquiring KD, the Golden State Warriors have won back to back championships. And now with contracts looming for uh, Draymond Green and uh, Clay Thompson, Draymond Green is really starting to lose it. Uh, they lost a game against the Clippers. Draymond decided to do some silly shit. You know what was funny about this game? These two were fighting for rebounds, fighting for the ball. It, it was just, it was just completely weird you know Draymond is one of the most dramatic um NBA players in the league and I mean that with all do I, I mean that with all disrespect <laughs> this guy is so dramatic I mean if he ain't if he ain't pulling his junk out in front of people or slapping somebody he doing silly shit on the court just like he did last night you know KD is the finisher give him the ball to finish the game why are you running down the court <laughs> recklessly with the ball trying to play hero? That ain't the way y'all designed. But I get it. You want that $200 million contract. You trying real hard to win defensive player of the year after KD said he wanted to be def defensive player of the year. And now you got Klay Thompson talking about he want to be defensive player of the year. I don't know if this smells disaster for uh, the Golden State Warriors, but without Steph Curry being on that floor hurt, you're really starting to see the tension between these two. You know, Draymond Green lost his mind. He just got a big mouth. You know what I'm saying? And his big mouth is going to cost him. A, a, it might cost him. It might cost him. They might wind up trading Draymond Green to another team before the trade deadline. That's what I'm thinking. If I'm the owner of the uh, Golden State Warriors, this is what, hey, we got a headache. We trying to keep KD here. <laughs> we could go find another big. We got DeMarcus Cousins. We could give him a contract. So I don't know what Draymond Green is doing, but <sighs> something's going on upstairs, man. Something is going on upstairs. I think something upstairs I think somebody from upstairs came down and tapped Draymond Green on the shoulder like, hey, bro, they thinking about getting rid of you. And I think that, you know, usually usually those kind of actions that, you know, players give off, it has to be somewhere from upstairs because now he's starting to act a little bit more erratic. He's being more dramatic. He's going overboard. Um, he know damn well KD was supposed to have the ball to shoot that damn last shot to win the game against the trash-ass Clippers. Who think they run LA? A lot of question marks right here between these two. Um, and you know, KD is one of those guys. If you rub him the wrong way one time, and you know you're doing it in public in front of thousands of fans, eh, it, don't, it don't sit too well with KD. KD's gonna give you the cold shoulder. And I think that might happen with, I think that's going to happen with Draymond Green. I think it's going to be a little bit more tension. KD didn't even show up to the, to the press conference afterwards. He didn't even go talk to the reporters. He got fined for that. <laughs> ah, feels good to be a Laker fan right now. So y'all let me know what y'all think. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment. <laughs> This is this is funny. Why now? Why now? Y'all got a chance to three P. Why now? Why now, Draymond Green? Why all of the antics now? I mean, you going off on a Finals MVP, screaming and yelling at him on the bench, getting everything all stirred up, man. What are you doing? What are you doing? And of all people that had to calm you down was Demarcus Cousins. Draymond Money Green, what are you doing? But anyway, man, I'm out of here, man. 